Camera's rolling. Here we go. Andy Warhol is the most influential person in the pop art movement. He took everyday items and turned them into enchanting, colorful art pieces. He used touch techniques and subject matter. With his combination of interesting techniques, subject matter, and popping colors, he was the ideal pop artist. Andy Warhol changed the way that we perceive everyday items. Andy Warhol had a very interesting early life. Warhol was born on August 6, 1929 in Pittsburgh and he died on February 22, 1987 in New York City. Andy Warhol was the youngest of three children. His parents were Slovakian immigrants. Their names were Andre Warhol and Julia Warhol. Both Julia and Andre Warhol were Byzantine Catholics and Warhol attended Mass regularly. At age 8 in 1936, Warhol got cholera. Cholera is a serious disease that deals with the nervous system. Warhol was bedridden for several months. It was in this time that his mother, a skillful artist herself, gave him his first drawing lessons. Andy Warhol also loved movies. When his mother bought him his first camera at age 9 in 1937, he took up photography and developed film in the makeshift darkroom in their basement. During school, Warhol went to free art classes at Carnegie Institute for Art. Warhol graduated from Skidley High School in 1945. Once he graduated, he went on to Carnegie Institute for Technology, now known as Carnegie Mellon University. This all happened in 1945. At Carnegie Institute for Technology, Warhol studied pictorial design. In 1944, Warhol graduated from college with a Bachelor of Fine Arts degree and moved to New York City. In New York, Warhol hoped to pursue the career of being a commercial artist. Also, in 1949, Warhol said goodbye to the A at the end of his last name to become Andy Warhol. In September, Andy got a job with Glamour magazine. He became the most successful artist of the 1950s. Warhol won numerous awards for his special techniques. He unveiled a new concept called pop art for the first time in 1961. Warhol showed his famous Campbell suit cans in 1962. These paintings made the current art world stop and stare at the concept of pop art and Andy Warhol. He opened an art studio that he called The Factory in 1964. One of the things that Warhol explored with was filmmaking. He made more than 60 films. Two of his most famous films were Sleep and Eat. The movie Sleep showed a man sleeping for six hours, and the movie Eat showed a man eating a mushroom for 45 minutes. Andy Warhol died at age 58. Warhol's art impacted thousands of people and artists across the world in his time and still years later to come.